Dance. Interactions with the player character. Fallout 4 Interactions Overview Interactions This character is essential. Essential characters cannot be killed. This character is a permanent companion. They grant the Know Your Enemy perk. This character is a temporary companion. This character starts quests. Call to Arms Semper Invicta The Lost Patrol This character is involved in quests. Fire Support Shadow of Steel Show No Mercy Blind Betrayal Liberty Reprimed Airship Down This character is romanceable. Requires Romance Dance. Interactions with the player character. Fallout 4 Quests Fire Support. The sole survivor assists Dance and his team to fight off a wave of feral ghoul attacks at the Cambridge Police Station. Call to Arms. The sole survivor accompanies Paladin Dance to Arcjet Systems, which is overrun with Institute synths. Semper Invicta. Dance directs the sole survivor to assist Halen and Reese with their tasks. The Lost Patrol. The survivor is asked to find what happened to the last Brotherhood Recon team. Shadow of Steel. The survivor and Paladin Dance board the Pridewind. Liberty Reprimed. The survivor must secure a nuclear payload. Once found, Dance stays on site to protect the cache. Blind Betrayal. Elder Maxon orders the survivor to find and execute Dance after it is revealed he is a synth. Airship Down. If Blind Betrayal has not been completed he will make his last stand with the Brotherhood of Steel, landing with the rest of Recon Squad Gladius and, if the Lost Patrol was completed, Paladin Brandis. Dance. Interactions with the player character. Fallout 4 effects of player's actions maximum approval with Dance awards the Know Your Enemy perk which grants plus 20% more damage against ghouls, super mutants, and synths, which cannot be acquired before completing Blind Betrayal. Dance is a potential candidate for romance, an option that unlocks after reaching the highest level of affinity. It is impossible to max out the relationship with Dance before completing Blind Betrayal. Siding against the Brotherhood before Blind Betrayal turns him hostile removing him as a companion. Siding against the Brotherhood after blind betrayal results in Dance no longer interacting with the sole survivor. However, the player character still gets the lover's embrace bonus by sleeping near him, which appears to be a bug. The issue effectively removes Dance as a companion but it will not remove his perk. To keep Dance as a full companion following the main story, one must either side with the Brotherhood, or side with the Minutemen and choose not to become enemies with the Brotherhood of Steel. The Railroad and Institute endings both force the player character into conflict with the Brotherhood. Dance. Interactions with the player character. Fallout 4 effects of player's actions. Range of interests, approvals, disapprovals, likes completing repeatable Brotherhood quests, entering power armor. Boarding a vertebrate they have called in. Offering to help settlers for the Minutemen. Making reasonable dialogue choices. Threatening Brother Thomas of the Pillars of the Community during Emmagine takes a lover, by saying, one way or another, I'm going to see her, when asking about Emmagine Cabot after passing a hard charisma check. Giving Sheffield Nuka Cola. Saying, yes, when Vadim Bobrov asks if the player character has been in a bar fight during Confidence Man. Killing Theodore Collins during Mystery Meat. Helping Barney Rook turn on his turrets during Gun Run. Threatening Finn when first arriving in Good Neighbor. Being sarcastic to Finn when first entering Good Neighbor. Picking the peaceful option when talking to Daisy about the past. Helping Fred Allen get a hallucinogen gas canister. Giving Danny a stimpack during In Sheep's Clothing. Siding with Ironsides during the quest Last Voyage of the USS Constitution. Finishing the mission Last Voyage of the USS Constitution. Replying, I regret it, when Piper asks of Kellogg's death. Replying, interesting, when talking with Jack Cabot the first time. Telling Officer Edwards that one is, just a traveler, when asked about their business inside Vault 81. Giving Austin the full cure during the quest hole in the wall. Humoring Gabriel when confronting him during the quest synth retention on his hidden stash, and then rescinding upon it. Being sarcastic to the courser during the Battle of Bunker Hill upon first arriving there. No affinity will be accrued if the sole survivor does not inform the Brotherhood first. Killing the courser during the Battle of Bunker Hill. Agreeing to take Billy home during the quest kid in a fridge. Telling Bullet that Billy is under your protection during kid in a fridge. Completing the experiment at Cambridge Polymer Labs. Agreeing to be the general of the Minutemen. Powering on radio freedom during taking independence.
completing the quest the nuclear option for the Minutemen, talking sarcastically to any member of Church of the Children of Adam, asking Holly if she's joking, accepting rogue robot quests from the Mechanist, healing Andre Michaud, offering to protect Far Harbor, choosing customer profiling as the parameter for the slot machine prototype during Lady Luck, telling Harvey, I understand, when meeting him after running the gauntlet, lying to Sierra Petrovita that you have heard of her Nuka-Cola museum, offering to help Sierra in her search, telling Nisha the world needs rules, telling Shelby Chase, I'm not scary, at Nuka Town Market, telling Gage you don't want the job in the overboss quarters, loves doing anything negative towards super mutants, such as convincing Virgil he needs to die, crafting weapon, armor, or power armor upgrades, accepting the public knowledge quest from Daisy, asking for caps after completing Boston after dark, convincing Dr. Lee to work on Liberty Prime, doubled if using the option, saving the Commonwealth, telling Dr. Chambers that someone must destroy the Institute, during human error attacking Mayor McDonough on the spot during the quest in sheep's clothing telling Hancock that it sounds like anarchy after entering Good Neighbor for the first time, telling Fred to kill Jules during the random encounter, killing Gabriel after refusing his attempt to bribe the sole survivor before X6-88 to can recite the recall code during synth retention, informing Elder Maxon of the synths at Bunker Hill during Battle of Bunker Hill, killing the synths in the bunker during the Battle of Bunker Hill, completing Outside the Wire, giving Paladin Brandis his squad's holotags during the Lost Patrol, convincing Paladin Brandis to rejoin the Brotherhood during the Lost Patrol, turning against the Nuka World Raiders in open season, dislikes giving Virgil the serum, positive conversations with ghouls, using bribes in dialogue, using chems, cannibalism, saying neutral things about synths, attacking non-hostiles, building artillery for the Minutemen at the castle, choosing, speak covertly, in the third option of dialogue with Old Man Stockton in the mission Boston After Dark, sarcastic remarks, picking an owned lock, freeing Lorenzo Cabot, giving chems to Mama Murphy, digging up Shem Drown, telling Billy his parents are probably long dead, selling Billy to Bullet, accepting Whitechapel Charlie's job offer, the cleaner, after buying a drink from him, asking Dr. Chambers to spare Amelia Stockton during human error, accepting Dr. Chambers' offer to the sole survivor during human error, replying, I'd do it again, when Piper talks of Kellogg's death, betraying or sticking with Bobby no nose during the big dig, offering to split the cure during the quest hole in the wall, informing the railroad of the Institute's knowledge of the synths at Bunker Hill during the Battle of Bunker Hill, joining Church of the Children of Adam, convincing Dima to destroy the nucleus, threatening Nisha, telling Ada, you're an individual, during the quest headhunting, hates murder, telling Holly she looks good, joining the railroad, telling Hancock, I feel you, when first meeting him, saying positive things about synths, killing initiate Clark in the quest duty or dishonor, even if Clark attacks first during the conversation, allowing McDonough to escape during the quest in sheep's clothing, returning the Deathclaw egg to the nest, giving the vault tech representative a new home, accepting Pickman's gift, joking about Pickman's trophies, asterisk giving the holotape to Sturgis in inside job, aiding X6-88 to in the quest synth retention, asking X4-18 to for his grenades, flirting with other characters, while they are in a romance with him and traveling together, accepting Mila from Tinker Tom for the weather vane, quest, telling Deacon that, someone has to stop them, when asked about the institute keeping the cure during the quest hole in the wall, convincing Fred to free Jules during the random encounter, telling Desdemona one will contact Patriot for the railroad during the molecular level, adding defenses to Mercer safe house for the railroad, helping H2-22 reach Ticonderoga during Boston after dark telling Ray Nakano that synths are still people and that even if Kasumi is a synth, she needs help, considering destroying Far Harbor, location, when talking to Brian Richter, accepting the quest reformation from Dima, dance, interactions with the player character, Fallout 4 Other Interactions Dance. Interactions with the player character. Fallout 4 Other Interactions Dance has the authority to grant the sole survivor membership into the Brotherhood of Steel. 
Dance. Interactions with the player character. Fallout 4 comments Dance's location comments location. Requirement comment Diamond City. Entrance. It's a shame these people have to live in fear. Sheltering in this old stadium when all those perfectly good buildings are still standing outside. Good neighbor. Entrance. Safety's off. I don't like the look of this place one bit. Combat zone. Exterior. This place is barbaric. Is this really how far society has fallen? Boston Airport, before the barricades, having the pride when moored above the airport keeps the brotherhood within striking distance of the city. Cabot House, exterior by the shrubbery, interesting. A structure in this condition might contain pristine pre-war artifacts. We should search it carefully. Parsons State Insane Asylum, entrance foyer on the rug just past the front door. During the quest, the secret of Cabot House. All signs point to this location being extremely dangerous. We should proceed with caution. Jamaica Plain, Northwest Road entrance, by the diner. If there's really buried treasure in Jamaica Plain, I hope it's something that the Brotherhood would find useful. Vault 81, entrance walkway, Vault Tech built places like this to conduct unethical experiments on human beings. Just thinking about it makes me sick. A submarine would be a valuable addition to the Brotherhood's arsenal. Perhaps we'll learn something useful about them while we're here. This flotilla of junk looks suitable for the scum that calls it home. I don't understand the logic in reading these illustrated manuscripts. The plots are ludicrous. Hubris Comics, Top Floor Studio, an ancient television studio. This equipment could prove useful to the Brotherhood. I'm amazed you were able to get the engine to activate. Now all we have to do is hope that it remains stable. I'm astounded that this vessel's nuclear power plant is still viable. Yangtze 31, Bridge. I'm only going to say this once. Don't touch anything. You turn the wrong valve, you could flood the entire vessel. Starlight drive in, in the projection room, area looks clear. Perhaps we should stop here and rest for a bit. Starlight drive in, at the screen. I've never been fortunate enough to watch a moving picture show before. Wilson Automatoys Corporate HQ, Arlen Glass Office, amazing. This room appears to be totally untouched by the ravages of war. Wilson Automatoys Corporate HQ, foyer display. That mechanical animal lacks sufficient capability to serve as a proper traveling mount. What's the point? Wildwood Cemetery. If you think this is grim, imagine how many people didn't have the luxury of a proper burial after the bombs hit. I hope this sewage doesn't wreak havoc with the servos on my power armor. West Everett Estates, Backyard Bunker. This is an excellent fallback point if things get too hot. Our new mission priority should be cleansing this town of its super mutant infestation. Walden Pond, just in front of said cabin. Hmm, I remember this author. Wrote something about going into the woods to discover how he lived or something? Milton General Hospital, Basement Morgue, be very careful. It's likely that this entire area is biologically contaminated. Milton General Hospital, waiting foyer. Facilities like this were funded by privately owned corporations more interested in making a profit than helping mankind.
These filthy insects will eat anything. Boston Common, just in front of the armored personnel carrier. Every map of this area we've recovered has the common marked with a big red X. I guess we'll find out why. South Boston Military Checkpoint. Well, that sounds familiar. The Brotherhood uses similar recall messages in times of war. Skylanes Flight 1981. This plane is amazingly intact. The pilot must have executed an impressive landing. This scrap would be useful for repairing power armor. I'll have to make a note of this location. These raiders have become annoyingly resourceful. We'll have to put a stop to that. Damn it. These raiders are using power armor. Aim for the fusion core. Sandy Cove's convalescent home, captain's room. These robots are completely ignoring the fact that their charges have passed away. They must have a fault in their programming. Rangers patrolled the woods seeking retribution for crimes against the environment. Not so different from the Brotherhood. Robotics disposal ground, in front of the sentry bot. That's a military grade robot ahead. We should approach with extreme caution. It's impressive that this oversized wooden walkway is still intact. Revere Beach Station, end tunnel raider encampment. If you intend to head through that tunnel, we'll have to take down those raiders first. Unless I'm mistaken, it appears that these people killed each other. Rest well, little one. Quincy Ruins, Freeway Stronghold Bridge to Roof Catwalks, we have to be careful. One solid hit in the right place could bring this whole overpass crashing down. Hasn't man done enough damage with these nukes already? This is actually nicer than some medical facilities I've seen on the battlefield. I'd be surprised if we find anything of value in this vault. Pre-war currency isn't really useful anymore. University point, just inside the gate. Now maybe you'll believe me when I tell you that the institute cares very little about the commonwealth. Damn sniper. Coward couldn't even face us on the field of battle. This is disgusting. I can't believe Mass Fusion dumped these barrels here. Mass Fusion Disposal Site. This is the perfect example of how environmentally irresponsible the ancient corporations behaved. By the time the Great War started, Mass Fusion supplied power for almost the entire Commonwealth. Watch for ambushes and check your fire. Macra Fishpacking. Basement Storeroom. I've never been fishing before. I wonder if it's even possible these days. Does he really think this is going to stop us? When you're doing deep recon, you get used to eating whatever you can find. On the other hand, I think I'd rather starve than eat this stuff. Vault 81, Observation Room. 
This is exactly the reason that science never belonged in the private sector. I'm going to guess that the residents of this vault didn't even know this section existed. Let's see if we can get these rats to leave the sinking ship. Libertalia, at the top of the main structure, so much for Libertalia. I recommend against entering that lake. The radiation levels are dangerously high. Kingsport Lighthouse, at the top beacon. The only thing those glowing ones are useful for is decorating the pavement when I gun them down. WRVR Broadcast Station, Control Room, ah yes, the home of the famed, Charles River Trio. What? You're not the only one with a radio, you know. Jamaica Plain, Treasure Room. Pre-war artifacts are more valuable than treasure. They give us glimpses at moments in time that will never repeat. Jamaica Plain, security room. I'd definitely say that we're on the right track. Proceed with extreme caution. Jalbert Brothers' disposal, at the barn with the barrels, the children of Adam are strangely resistant to radiation. The Brotherhood spent years trying to learn why. So far, no luck. Super duper mart, front counters, this building's structural integrity has been compromised. I'd advise against the use of high explosives. Irish Pride Industries Shipyard, at the corpse of Rory Rigwell. This civilian's efforts to befriend these Mirelurks was misguided, and fatal. The thought of what must have transpired here sickens me. Cambridge Crater, Edge. Let's make sure that every single one of these ferals is eradicated. This would be an excellent spot to establish a listening post. I'll have to make a note of that. Another location to mark for the Brotherhood scribes. Hub City Auto Wreckers, while on the crane, impressive. I wonder if the gunners made this themselves or murdered the original builders. Hester's Consumer Robotics, Entrance, Showroom Floor. Feast your eyes on the height of man's decadence. How could mankind have allowed itself to become so lazy? Goddamn ferals chewed through these raiders like they were ragdolls. College Square, the square. Damn ferals are coming out of every crack in the ground. An infestation that needs to be exterminated. I'm surprised this place hasn't been stripped clean. Safety's off, we're about to have company. Fort Hagen, command center, outside the gated main room, next to the door. The equipment down here seems to be fairly intact. I wonder if any of it's still operational. Greater Mass Blood Clinic, basement storage. If this blood's still viable, it would be quite useful to the Brotherhood. Repurposing this recreational facility as a hydroponics experiment was very resourceful. Adam Katz Garage, unable to determine due to bugged content. Now that's a perfectly good waste of power armor. Gunner's Plaza, cafeteria, before the staircase, watch your footing, there are pieces of glass everywhere. Gunner's Plaza, main entrance of the atrium writer's room, the Brotherhood finds the press to be a necessary evil. In times of war, propaganda is just as important as bullets. When walking on a Meyerlurk infested beach, between Reed Marina and Gibson Point Pier, 
it would be smarter to avoid confrontations with these creatures. General Atomics Factory, Quality Assurance Test Chamber. When these things learn how to program each other, that's where the trouble begins. Back alley bowling, at the lanes. I wish we had a recreational facility like this back at our headquarters. General Atomics Galleria, at the gate. General Atomics is certainly pleased with themselves for designing the Mr. Handy. This should help. Don't leave anything behind. Fort Strong, sublevel in the room before the main mini nuke storage room. Can you imagine these weapons in the hands of those super mutants? West Roxbury Station, platform. Getting one of these antiques to run is quite an impressive feat of engineering. Amazing how the devastation from the war managed to change the water level in this town. Federal Surveillance Center, K21B, Gantry Overlook. I've heard of these places. Civilian on the outside. Military on the inside. Faneuil Hall. The Hall. All right. Even for me. That's pretty disgusting. Concord Civic Access. Main Pipe Room. I believe we're passing under the center of Concord. Catching a Deathclaw sleeping gives us a distinct tactical advantage. Fairline Hill Estates. At the Fortified House. Let's check out that house, but don't let your guard down. Coast Guard Pier. Either at the corner of the pier by the tower, or the center of the building. The super mutants were supposed to be wearing Coast Guard hats. As if regular super mutants weren't bad enough. Now we have to find something like this. It appears the vessel's navigator made a grievous miscalculation. Chestnut Hillock Reservoir, be on your guard. There may be something using that rowboat for cover. Super Mutant Excrement. The pungent stench is unmistakable. Shaw High School, Cafeteria. This doesn't bode well for what we're going to find in the rest of the school. Charles View Amphitheater. Listening to a performance here would have been extraordinary. We should search this laboratory from top to bottom for useful technical documentation. Cabot House. Laboratory. Nothing good can come of this place. Cabot House. Living room. Amazing. It's as if time itself has avoided this place. Bunker Hill. Base of the monument. A battle memorial to the fallen. We should observe a moment of silence. Breakheart Banks. At the building. Damn super mutants. They should be exterminated for their crimes against humanity. Boston Public Library, hall where defenses are, this library would be quite beneficial to our scribes. I'll have to make a note of its location. Boston Public Library, main entrance, the lion was such a noble and majestic creature. It's a shame they're extinct. Boston Mayoral Shelter, at the basketball court, why would politicians need a sporting arena? It makes no sense. I wonder what type of genetic experimentation was going on in this facility. May as well search the remains and look for anything of use. Beantown Brewery, bottling room floor. I haven't had a good beer in quite a long time.
Fallon's Department Store, West Roxbury Township, by the fountain. This fountain is just another example of the waste and excess of pre-war America. Fallon's Department Store, West Roxbury Township, by the escalators. I believe this automated staircase was used to convey individuals from one floor to the next. The epitome of laziness. Joe's Spucky's Sandwich Shop, Speakeasy Stairway. There appears to be an illicit drinking establishment concealed down here. The switchboard, the foyer of the agency. I don't recall the Brotherhood having any records on this agency. We should investigate further. BADTFL Regional Office, Evidence Lockup. Well, this is an unexpected surprise. We should take whatever we can carry. Quote. 